at YouTube. <laughs> um, I was sitting there this morning thinking, bod, bod stiff, as usual, like you do, yeah. And thought, hmm, well, I was looking at YouTube videos last night of um, people making Blu ray laser weapons and things like that, from like Xbox 360 Blu ray laser burners and things like that, and you know, PS3 laser burners. So I was thinking this morning, like I say, hmm, what to do? So I, I must, you must forgive me for the crudeness of actually how I've done this, but. Anyway, have a look. I've got to give the shakiness of the camera. I've got I've taken blue rear diode out of here, out of this. Simple mechanism. Simply just pops out from underneath. Oh, there's a little blue hole. This blue hole here. There is some focusing lenses. There are some focusing lenses among, ar around here, and there's one main one here, which fits that. Now this is probably, I'd say this is probably the most decent one for it, but mounting that would be a nightmare. Mounting this little bugger would be a nightmare. So how I've mounted it, how I've mounted the actual diode on a piece of wood, just focus on a piece of wood, simple crude little thing, yeah. And at this end is the diode. I've got a little. I did have a battery operated 9 volt battery inside here, but the battery is going on it and it's making the diode dim. <laughs> Don't like it. So I've made use of the on off switch from it and um, bodged, like I say, crudeness, <laughs> bodged a multi power, multi power supply to it. Simple, you know pick up anywhere for about three four quid. I picked this up for I think it was two ninety nine from um, Power Stretcher I think it was. Anyway like I say simple crude design 150 ohm resistor in line with it. In line there. Also the wiring for it is all over the fucking place. Pardon my French or German, depends on how you want to call it. Anyway, business end. Here we go. I've simply mounted the actual diode inside a bracket. As you can see, so you can just, let me get a screwdriver. It's just there. It's just inside there. Can you see? I've you have soldered the actual diode here, like you can see here. I've soldered the actual diode to the bracket, so I can then use the bracket as the ground itself. Hence, why that's soldered there. Um, again, crude. Again, very, very crude. <laughs> um, I must, I must state this while I'm here now. I'll probably have to put some kind of um, filters and some kind of um, some kind of light filter or something like that. I'll look into it and put a sort that out later on top of here. Um, and then what I'm going to do is obviously it's mounted to a piece of wood. And then I'm going to see this little piece of wood here. I'm going to whack it on another bracket and I'm going to mount um, a high power. Well, a very strong magnifying glass on top of here, on top of this piece here, and then the idea will be is I'll have blue ray diode here, 
focus lens, uh, uh, not focus lens, um, some kind of lens to clean it up, clean the light up on top of here, then a focus lens next to it, another one after that, and then I'm going to have my call it magnifying glass on here, and then I'll make, I'll fig try and figure out where the actual distance is to focus it, focus actual laser. So, uh, so it's really, really strong. I mean, proper, 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 proper strong laser. And then at this end, where these little three knots are, I'm going to put like a little metal metal stand, something like that. Play, play about that high, something like that. And then that's where I'll know where the burn point is. If you know what I mean, where the hot, where the heat spot is for it to ignite a cigarette. Ha ha ha. And well, that's the whole idea. I'm bored, and I've decided to make a Blu-ray diode cigarette laser lighter. <laughs> Crude, but well, there you go. Anyway. Hope you enjoyed the video. If um, you want to get in contact with me about anything, then by all means. Right. Ciao.